Sonoma. Two hours, 45 minutes. And it used to be, I believe, an IMSA sports car event. Using this, however, it will be nothing of it. Nothing of the sort. Because, let's just say, after encountering a Sauber, which decided to go away like sand blowing in the wind, I had enough. So now, it's met its match. And quite frankly, its match it's go is going to kill it. Oh, man. Oh, look, there it is. They're all Group C. There's only one... There's only G one GT1 car in this. Now, there's, there's going to be a different strategy for this. Because this is going to take a very long time, I feel like I'm going to skip some of it. Just... Add some speed to it, and not give you the entire length, because... No. Yeah, I tried to catch it earlier, big face. Oh god, it's, the Jag's gone into the freaking mud. Ah, what is it, what's it like to be, feel like you're going behind, you git? The, uh, there goes the R89 which has just grazed me. The 787 b has rocketed off, but not for long. The brakes are damn near no better than the Toyota 7s. Although this is way faster. When is the first 24-hour race? Um, I'm not too sure yet. We'll have to figure it out. Oh my god, stop! At least three weeks away. Yes! Because remember, I'm doing these weekend by weekend. I have no idea. But now I'm in the lead. And permanently in the lead. Because I am not being defeated by Mercedes. Yep. And that is, yeah, going to take at least another three weeks. The Citroen C5. Well, to be fair, to be fair, I think there's one or two road cars in it. Uh, I think Fuji will actually take a little bit less than Suzuka. He got a Citroen C5 to do 170 miles an hour. What? Yeah, because there's big, long straights to enjoy. There's a big, long straight to enjoy. Stop car!
on New Jack. Are you kidding me? No, oh, Fuji checks were not in. Uh, the 2010 version was in GT5 and 6. The 2010 version had higher curbs, I believe. Stop! Ooh, beef brisket. Mmm. Yeah. Yes, he also smashed a chair over the side of someone's head. Quite frankly, the man is dangerous and should never work in the business again. Whoa, why did the why did the revs go up all of a sudden? Yeah, it should. It's got more it's got way more power. So I'm in third or fourth right now. I would say third. I'm cultaholic. I'm not surprised considering that everyone's got to self isolate and social distance. Social distancing, which I'd like to remind you, is not exactly working, and self isolation is not working either. Five seconds are that faster than the Toyota 7. What? Oh my god, please, please, vehicle. Well, then. See. What's the first thing you're going to do? I'm going to ride my motorcycle straight to the beach. Because it'll be nice and hot and I'll, I can finally enjoy riding again. Even if I do need to put some petrol emulsifier in the tank. Because I haven't ridden it in three weeks and I miss riding it. Pencil shavings. What, in the hopes of getting high? What? No, I don't live in the south coast. I live in a 
I live in a, I live in a metropolitan area. I doubt you're making it up, Daniel, because of course it's New Jack and his mates. Welsh. I Welsh. Oh my god, that's the gravel! Rear tires feel like they're about to, they're gonna start letting go soon. I need equal tire wear, so I'm gonna put I'm gonna put super hards on the rear, mediums on the front. Oh please stop car. It's off the gravel. Comfort hard, no. A good heel or a good face. Be easy to be a good heel. The nutty burger ring. The Battenberg ring, yeah, I don't know. I'll have to find out. That's the Parnos. But once it gets to half a tank, I'm changing the tires out and then tires and fuel. I'll be just as good as the Sauber. Well, the 787B, I believe, is lighter than the Sauber because it has a much smaller engine. Well, when you're in a sea of other good faces, Daniel, of course it's going to be difficult. No one likes the same thing over and over again. That includes myself. Look at Big Boy Minolta. Should say so, yeah, Daniel. Yeah, 
Yeah, I know. I did some without without rally cars. Yes, because it was just another. It was just another, another baby face. Oh, get off the grass! Taking the escape route. Right, new tyres, because they are dead. Oh lordy, some water. Delicious, delicious water. <laughs> I heard you like orange cones. Yeah, that is, um, it's a bit weird how, um, how the game does it. Right, let's go. Right, fresh tyres. I have got to get moving now. The Jag's pitting in. And we're back. Everything.exe stopped working. Yes! Everything.exe did indeed stop working. I have no idea what has happened with OBS. But something certainly did. Also, who pitted? Uh, the Jag did. No bot.exe, yeah. The salve is pitting in. Nissan's pitting in, which means the Mazda is on my tail. Maybe there's something seven people's holding it up. Yeah. I think it was as well. No, it wouldn't. That's just insulting. Standard headlock. Parnos is pitting in. Mazda's still going. Clean air, so I can at least get away from it. Oh, my God, I forgot to steer. That didn't, that shouldn't have happened. Oh my God. 
or you want me to legitimately kill the guy? Hey, Romain, how are you? Yeah, 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 I know, Stream Elements. It was an OBS accident. Let's just leave it at that. Right, Mazzy is pitting in. But too tired to race. Hmm. I'm not sure what my fish would be, Daniel. Come on, then, move it. Yeah, we got to remember that the AI stops for fuel and tires. So my lead extends. Does it do a super kick? No. Might get a second. I reckon it will. God, it's hot in here. It's uncomfortably warm in here, but I can't open the windows. It's faster in this game, I believe. Off the gravel. So it seven B wasn't that special. It was equipped with super hards, which made it a formidable force in like I don't know the GT World Championship. The Group Three trio. Ah, uh, it. I would say I would say it's way, way more reliable, but this game doesn't have engine reliability. Phone's telling me stuff for some reason. Wow, that turbo lag is horrendous. A knock off him over, badass. What have I told you? Hell no. Fifty three seconds ahead of the of this seventy eight seven B, so it's not all bad. The undead taker. Really gonna stop hitting those curbs.
Thanks for slowing me down, dude. See ya. Thanks for the brakes. Oh, God. Come on. Move it. Sweet 16. Thank you for the follow, Dadu. Welcome to right now what is the single hottest sweltering sweat box you'll ever be in. It is so hot in here. And I'm not even anywhere near the, I'm not even anywhere near the halfway point. Stop! To avoid copyright infringement. Yeah, but remember, people can take copyright into um, into gimmicks now. So even if, even if you change the name, the gimmick can still be copyrighted. That's the jag. The sail passed him with the worst brakes of any Group C car. I didn't know they used toast and jam as brake pads in this game. Whoa. Jesus, that caught me quick. What is that super glue? See you, Jack. Share a picture of a post of a knockoff tribute show from the late 90s. God. That sounds like the worst thing in the world. believe the rear tires are going to let go sometime soon. Oh, man. Rock breakfast as an unpopular people's champion. We can catch up to the Sauber and the, 70 and the R89C. There they are. Out of the way, Sauber machine. It might, oh my god, I sent it straight off the course. Jesus, webbed. Well, that's his race ruined. Get out of the way, you friggin' spaniel move. It's pushing me. Alright then. Get in that. Get in that. Go on. Yeah, yeah, you're not. You're not pushing me now, and that I pushed you straight off. 
Right, two laps till refuel and tyres. Two laps till I open windows. Oh Lord. I got some enjoyment on watching. Because they're, they're just laughably bad, I guess. It's been half an hour. I don't know how it's been half an hour, to be honest. If that's the case, it's going to be, I don't know, another 68 laps. Oh my god. Grandmasters of Wrestling, that already sounds bad. Four of them released, no six. Breaking has been badly affected. Run the pits. Oh, I almost had it in the pits. And the other two were from a show from 1997. Oh god, that sounds bad. Jack's pitting in again. shoulders a bit. Braking has been horribly compromised by very worn tyres. Whoa, traction control can't kick it in despite it not existing on these cars. Alright, it goes in. I'm now opening some windows. I'm back. Apparently... The guy running it used, used my you know, say French fencing team to the Jewish Olympics. What? That sounds stupid. Right, windows open. Hopefully it becomes a little bit more comfortable though. Easy to have a coolest wings. They're big wings. What can, what do you want? Don't know how far I am ahead.
R89C pitting in. Sauber pitting in. Be fat and shit. What? Oh god, please no. Apparently steering does not exist on uh going up the hills. That'll be a problem later. I made the worst noises when he was selling. Listen, as so long as they weren't robotic, I'll take it. So long as he's not going, ow, my leg. Get off my head. Who he couldn't wrestle? Oh dear. Oh god, the yawns. The yawns are setting in, and that is not good. All of the full DVDs. Sounds terrible. Parnos is finally pitting in. Oh, please don't do that. We are 38 minutes in. When they had when they had Michael, Michael Schumacher, definitely. Oh Lord. Maybe. 
I didn't follow Formula 1 before I was born. Also, I think you can hear my voice. I am very tired. Didn't get a lot of sleep last night because of the heat. So yeah, seven. It's been again. Oh, that's right. It's on a twenty-eight flap, isn't it? Quite a bit earlier than that. See ya, rotary power. Hey Scare, how you doing? Did Nate finally go to bed after doing a stupid amount of hours awake? We need to get pinned. Well then. Didn't even know it would be a good finisher. God. My oh, eyes are starting to get a bit worn. Definitely, um, I am definitely gonna hand it over to B Spec Barney after these two stints because I need tea. Valentino is nodding off. I think the arenas will be a bit too small for that. Plus, um, small confined spaces, um, engines are banned. Because guess what? Carbon monoxide kills.
oxygen kills too. Well, if you have too much oxygen, yeah, it, it legit can. At least use feeder as your theme. Probably. Yes. If you if you fed too much oxygen at too uh, in a short amount of time, you can actually suffocate. Your lungs can legit burst. And that's why nitrogen in the air acts as a stabilizer. <laughs> chemistry 101 with me, who has no degree in chemistry at all. Also, it is still uncomfortably warm. It may have something to do with the fact that I'm sitting on a PU seat. Yep, but I'm nearly finished with GT4. I still, I've got the endurance events to do and the F1 stuff. Science with Torrent. Still a lap ahead of a 787B. I'll be quiet, you. Get out of the way. Go in the pits. Aww. Be funny if I actually got it, got it forced into the pits. Hey, I raced my way. Technically, I am not rude to AI since AI have no feelings. Yeah, it was the F. There was the F two thousand seven. And then there was sort of a Red Bull, or it was a uh, something. I can't remember. Number twenty ten Ferrari. Rear tires are about to die. Oh my god, how, how do I grip so much? Perhaps it's because the fronts have a lot of grip. Compared to the rears, which have none. Jags picking it again. What can I say? License deals outside of Codemasters. Allows that to happen, Daniel. Right, let's get it in. Whoa! Gravel! The gravel apparently is Gorilla Glue. 
All right. All right, water to keep me hydrated and awake. We are 50 minutes, well, nearly 50 minutes anyway, into our race. We go. Oh, look, it's the Parnos. See you, Parnos. Alright, 48th lap. I'm going to hand it over to B Spec Barney. Let's see how he makes of it. Ooh, the wall has definitely woke me up. One minutes means we have less than two hours to go. Well, at least in game time. Of course, I will be doing something which will speed up the process because the video will be too long. Nine's pitting in, and so will the Sauber. They're fighting for third, which is good to see. Meanwhile, the lonely Jag is being left behind by both of them because it just cannot hold onto its tyres. Stop. There we are. Catch up to is that the uh, that the Sauber and the I nine looks like it. Oh, yes, it is. Hello, Mr. Sauber. Goodbye. I'm way faster than you. Ooh, 118.6. That's damn fast. Actually, I think we've got a 118. No. Don't think so. Bye. Of course, they get Grosjean's loaders, wouldn't they? Let's 
See ya. Yeah, that's true. Kimi Raikkonen also did very well on the Lotus. We're bumbling up and down, car. Please stop. I thought Kimi Raikkonen got multiple podiums. In fact, multiple wins for him, didn't he? What, in 25th? Oh, it was 2013. That, that's right. My pause is picked again. Ooh, how long before I overtake it once more? It wasn't being paid, oof. Me, oh God, those curbs are higher than bloody Mount Kilimanjaro. They could knock anything off. Stop. The grip on the flat curb. Nicely done through the first sector. Now for sector two. Round down the carousel. If it is even called that. Also, isn't that a drag strip? Right, coming through into sector three. Laps to another pit. Oh, 
Oh my god. That was close. Thank god for traction control. Right, that's the 787 b pin again. Two bars of fuel to go. These tyres are doing surprisingly well, Vistin. Oh, stop! Damn it, go too fast and you can't stop at all. Going up a simple hill. God. Sheesh. Two laps to go. Turn in. You still got grip on the front, just turn. Also, I didn't realise that they were 117. I don't think I was paying attention to the damn timer anymore. I am so naked. That's what happens when you have less than seven hours sleep. And there goes three other cones. There's some flown over the field. Jack's pitting in. Oh, 
my lap and I'll grab a cup of tea. Bus, I am very low on fuel now. Oh my god, yep, yeah, rear tyres definitely let go now. Finished recording replay. Oh no, what will I do? Alright, in it goes. Barney's in. Oh lord! Oh. Barney's, it's time for Barney to do his job. Now, as usual, I will stick him on um, on standard pace and increase his pace once his tyres warm up. But first, I need to grab a cup of tea. <laughs> Seriously, I'm that good, man. I can't take this anymore. I must have a nice hot caffeinated drink. Right, put him on overtake. And I will be right back.
I'm back. How is B Spec Barney done? Let's have a look. His laps are five seconds a lap slower. Although his tires are warm now, so I'm gonna put him on increased pace. And what I'm more interested in is the fight between the Sauber and the R89C. Mm. Catching quickly. Scalding hot cop. Cup. I mean, ow. 1.26. So he is starting to close the gap on the timer a little bit. Which is a good indication that B Spec Barney is doing his job. Also, I'm aware that my headphones did indeed hit my microphone. is finally pin although I am watching Twitch stream first need to find out what the quality is like your last lap boy 127 and he slipped off the damn grass are you kidding me man come on quit lollygagging and start moving these two doing we're still fighting each other what was the latest lap times well the Nissan's starting to pull away oh for god's sake man you're a disgrace
cones on the road, which indicates something hit it. Well, he's not that much faster than the 787B now, so I guess that is a great success. Yeah, the Jag went off. Now, of course, after this stint, I'm going to um, turn him up a bit. I'm going to increase the speed of the race because this video will this video would go on for friggin' ever. Trust me. And right now, it's very warm in here, and PS2 can't really take it. So I might as well speed up it, speed it up. I know it's a bit cheating, but still. But that is until I get back into my stint, which will be the next three pit stops. Yes, I'm using the slim PS2. That's a 2004 model. Um, I got one of the, I got, um, a later model, um, disc scanner. So, it should be fine when it's scanning the disc. It's just the heat, especially right now, is unbearable. It hit 25 degrees and it is still something like 15. It's not brilliant. No, it's, it hit 25 degrees C. It was 15. It's 15 degrees C now. It's humid. Real humid. It's according to my phone. What does it, what's it say on Met Office? Let's have a look. Yep, 15 degrees. And uh, tomorrow is going to hit 20, but it's going to, but it, but the temperature is going to plummet to a much more comfortable nine. But then it will start raising back up later down the week. Oh lord, can I not catch a break? I'm walking around shirt. It's a 10 degrees C with no sun, just with sunshine. The problem is we can't go anywhere right now because the lockdown's irritating. And to be honest, I think it would be better if I was safe. At least until everything calms down a bit, which it does seem to be a little bit. Yeah, it is a shame that the states are getting so many cases. The United States currently sitting at something like half a million, which is horrific. Absolutely horrific.
Barney's doing very well protecting his tyres. Um, well, I say that as soon as he goes straight off the track. Well done. You're being caught up by the Jaguar. And he... What? No. No. Oh, I was going to say... I was going to say, what in God's name are you that slow that the 78 b has decided to catch up? Actually, what lap times is it doing? 125, which is... Oh. Oh, did the um, Mazda pit then? Pit earlier than I thought. Well, now it's got some nice clean air and hopefully you don't crash again. Ugh. Ah! Better. Ah! <laughs> Stop mocking me! Stay on the track, you fool! Do 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 do. Well, the tracking isn't very good then. First half of the track, yes, of course they do, because the AI is very stupid. All right, I'm gonna have to bring it in for some tight for tires and fuel for tires now because his rears are gonna go. It's done very well. He's did four. He's did uh, two more laps than I did on tires. One hour 25, we are over the halfway mark. goes for tires but no fuel right Mazda is of course gonna come in no it's not gonna come in is it however we are still well ahead the R89C is now pitting in so is a Sauber so I guess it's not all bad news Better give up, I'll never pick up the phone. Thank you very much for the follow. Lo oh my lord. Lolica Piz one. I think I got that right. Welcome welcome to the stream, how you doing? They're still close together. What is this fight for podium?
Oh, I got it right. I guess it's first time lucky. My dog has decided to become very interested in the vacuum cleaner. No idea why, but you know. You can never get enough spider bait. Despite me showing the dog that there's nothing under the vacuum cleaner, she's still very interested in it. Well, I am now much more awake now that I've got tea down my system. Alright, once it hits 1 hour 30, I'm going to speed it up a little bit and see how how far he's gotten without being a pillock. Now, what I'm going to do, as soon as he crosses it, here we go. And what I can do here is that I can change the viewing speed using L1 and right. Yeah. This speeds up the laps quite drastically. Main reason for this is because uh, eh, it's just to speed up just a tad. I am aware it sounds like a vacuum cleaner is going in fast motion. Also, the Jag, the Salva, and the Nissan are all on the same lap. This is going to get interesting. Because what if the Salva spins out or the R89C spins out? Hmm. Oh, his tyres seem to be doing fine, but his fuel isn't. Parnell's pitting in. I don't know the lyrics. Something, something other. Oh, lordy. Oh, 
Why is Minolta fighting a Dalba? Oh, that was good. I needed that. I really needed that tea. Something, something other. I seriously don't have the lyrics to this song either. I am useless at singing, aren't I? Where's the... The Mazzy's crossing the line on the... Oh yeah, I'm on lap 69. Heh <laughs> Oh, the joke sucks. Oh lord, now good hiccups. That's not good. So, an update at the hour 37 mark. We're, we're nearly an hour to go. When is that master going to pit? No, it pits on the 72nd lap, I think. I believe so. Although it is starting to really catch up. Although the lap times aren't much different. Oh, God. What in the hell is this? They're all doing. They're all doing good laps. Well, apart from the jag, which is constantly spinning out and all, and all going on the grass and all killing itself. Oh God! There's no point in me seeing. Excuse me, while I look for stuff. At least the song's over, Jesus Christ. I was never a fan of Snow Patrol, and probably never will be, if I'm honest. Oh, Mazda went off a bit. Unusual. What I always found unusual about this as well is that you can probably see the front tires, they've got nice aerodynamic rims which allow the brakes to cool down 
while at the same time maintaining aerodynamic pressure. On the rear is the deep dishes. Which allows none of the saw. So you're getting a nice curve, a nice aerodynamic curve across the side, and then you just get this big dip. I don't know how the Mazda handled well with that aerodynamic fault. And the Mazda's pitting. See you, Mazda. Enjoy your pit. Oh, God, I just realized how much fuel he's got. Oh, okay. As soon as he hits, um, did the real car have those traits? I don't, I don't know. I'll, I'll take a look now. So, it's going to be... It kind of did and it didn't. I think while it was racing at Le Mans, it did, but in some images, I'm seeing they're all deep dishes. So it's very difficult to tell if it actually um, had those traits or not. Alright, you are coming in this lap. You are very low on fuel. Most of that's probably spent going on the grass. Bull's face. Look at them. Look at them. Why? I told you to I told you to increase your pace, not go on the grass, you moron. You need fuel and tires because soon enough it's just going to blow the tires anyway, so I might as well pit you in for them. Right, off you go. Now, move it, move it. Where's the Mazda? Oh, that's not good. Yeah, I think my blunder with the fuel and the tyres definitely cost us some time. However, with one hour to go, we should be okay. At least I think.
All right, time for you to punch it now, man. You need to get a move on. Good God, you didn't go on the grass this time. That's astonishing. Back's hurt in the first place. I'm sitting on the bleeding edge of the bucket seat. Something you don't want to be doing. vibration sound of that. I really don't. Your first time as LP. Yeah, definitely. Um, I reckon we're going to pass 25 laps, the next 25 laps, in about, what, half hour? Which means this race is going to do about 125 laps. However, I will be doing the last half an hour because I will need to uh, boost some of that lead. Which has been eroded badly.
I could pass him then. Come on, you're told to get passed. Now do it. That's it. Shunt them out of the way if you have to. See ya. Eat. Something, something, something. Hey, above the water. Hey, Jamie, how you doing? Where's the Mazzy at? Oh, it's starting to close in just a tad. Oh my god, come on man, move it, move, shift it. And stop slipping on the grass, you moron. Ninety P ninety three European Grand Prix at Donington. Ah, uh, but simply now well I was gonna say but now it's more like the sort of then Simply Sausages Raceway. I kid you not. Yeah, I'm doing okay. I was a little bit knackered earlier because falling asleep while uh, doing this is uh, never good. Something. I stop singing. You stop singing. You are just embarrassing yourself. You just stop. Oh my god. I just seen on the stream just. The Minolta just flying over the, uh, the, uh, the curb. What race is this one? This is the Infineon World Sports Car Challenge. Two hours and 45 minutes of stuff. Oh, for God's sake, man. And he's not slowing down for... Oh, he has. Dear God. Yes, after much torture, they finally actually got a chance to go and do stuff elsewhere. Right now, it's the worst time in the world to do that because... Well, look at it. Look at it outside. There's no one there. Oh, 
Alright. Alright. Oh, they'll be they'll be in all elite. Of course they will. Must I do, 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 do. Now I'm fifty six minutes in, fifty minutes to go. Well, less than 50 minutes to go. And it's still going to take a lifetime to finish. Do, 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 do. Quick, run off the road. You're not in the Celica, are you, mate? What the laps looking like if he just stopped going off the road? Look at them. No one of the tires are being shredded to hell. Where's the Mazzy? He's not. It's not that far behind, which means, uh, ooh, yeah, we're gonna be real close. There's the Mazda. It's not that far behind, but... Oh, this is getting close. Look at this! What are their lap times? Let's have a look. Ooh, that, that Nissan's getting away. I can't see what speed they're doing, which is so irritating. 
Well, I can actually, but let's see, 144. Oh, yeah, the Salvers. The Salver can really have it on the straights. But what straights? There aren't any. Oh, the mass is finally pitted in. And now it goes. Well, thank God that the lead's been extended a tad. Both well, for Sauber and the Mercedes. The Sauber and the Mercedes. The Sauber and the. Uh, Something, I don't know. Up ahead of the Mazda anyway. Yes, but B Spec Barney isn't very good at what he's doing right now. I do actually like this song, I'll be honest. of this game do the same mistake to whip out the beast spec driver only when they do the enduros he's lots of experience beforehand to have the same yeah I guess what race is this it's the uh, it's the Infineon World Sports Car Race 2 hours 45 minutes of racing because why not my back is also very itchy train B-spec drivers faster than during AI. Yeah, which is why I'm kind of training him now, to be honest. Uh, 
rear tyres are really starting to go, which means it's time for you to get in the fuel and tyres. Right, next pit stop. And then it'll be my go to get back in so I can at least increase the lead a bit. Head to the players tomorrow after watching you and Nate. Nate's a madman. She did 24 hours playing this while doing the thousand miles, what was it? One and a half times? Which, uh, I don't know about you, but that qualifies him as completely mad. We are f 35 minutes away. 35 minutes away, and then we're actually done. Okay, at least then go to sleep. Get up at half eight and do stuff. Like do an early morning workout. Do, 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 do,
I'd have to stream while I slept. Didn't expect him to be. Yeah, same to. I I I was the same to be honest. I did not expect him to just keep going. I would have expected him to sort of shut the game off halfway through, but he didn't. He just carries on and on. What is the dexterity of the of the guy? What does he What does he do for a living? Throwing javelins? Because there's no way he could he could just go on for 24 hours like that. I know Aero. I know Aero did. Um. For the uh, 24 hours of Daytona, but at least he had at least he had some kind of cause to keep going on. Nay, he just went on and on and on. Like Jesus, really? Ah. Oh. It's behind me. Yes, he did 24 hours of GT4. Or, well, technically not really 24 hours of GT4. He did something like 22 hours of it. And then he did some Resident Evil. Races weren't exactly sure. Yeah, I, I get that. But still, Jesus. No, he, he has he's got a wheel, but... He doesn't use it for emulation because emulation using a wheel is very difficult. And I actually mean that. It is very, very difficult. I actually do remember trying to uh, get this to work with a wheel um, during emulation. This was a couple years back. You either went completely left or completely right. Doesn't matter what rotation you had. It was one or the other. Hey, Zakid, how you doing? Yes. Yes, it is. It's right behind me. However, the stint after this one, uh, B-Spec Barney's next, next stint will be over and I will be extending my lead. It's gone past me. The 787B repellent. What, more power? No, because it wouldn't work around Sonoma. Or Infineon for, for those perfectionists. Human driving instead of the AI. Yes, human driving needs to be done as soon as he's done. In which... Uh, what? Some laps later? I know the 78 b has got to pit very soon. I think it has to pit the next lap. The next two laps. So that at least, it, he, at least Barney can recover some ground. I thought that was for position. No, he's a lap down still. 
but still, I need to extend the lead because sometimes Barney can be five seconds a lap behind. And it's because of stuff like this. And stuff like this. Okay, maybe not that, but he normally goes off the track there. I hate his curbs. I hate I hate my life doing this and I'm not an MP. Oh. Yeah, that's oof. It is a lot, lot faster, but Barney is still not that trained, which is why I'm kind of trying to get him, get him to do some training now, so that when it comes to Nürburgring and Le Mans, he can at least do the job. But I know for a fact it's going to take a long time. Come and dance with me, Michael. Hack GT saves. My God. I believe this thing's going to pit soon. The C9 chews through tyres, and so does a Minolta, to be honest. That's kind of why it's technically faster on the track. Oi, I thought you were pitting, you git. I never said this on it's going to be out race C9, but I can't be the authority of full GT4. <laughs> uh, Where are you pitting? Oh god, what is this? Oh, they're both pitting. I was going to say, was was one about to overtake, overtake the other? I didn't see who pitted. And so the Nissan goes first. Technically, the Salva is a faster car than the R89, but it struggles on the corners. Why isn't that thing pitting now? Overtaking is also an issue. Yeah, around Sonoma, definitely. But let's not forget, this is, of course, Sonoma. I will reiterate this again. It is Sonoma, not Infineon anymore. I see now it's close enough to be in the dirty air. It is, but it was in the dirty air for most of the time.
catch any of WrestleMania. I watched the first part and I gave up on the second part. Because, oh god, that last man standing match lasted forever and ever and ever and ever and ever. And with no crowd, it just made it so boring. Do, do, do. Oh my lord. Oh, the Mazda's actually pitted. Good lord. Right, now Barney can at least pull out a little bit of a lead. Yeah, I, I, I don't know. Like you at least pull something out. You pull something out your ass now, mate. Come on, get a move on. Do do do. Oh God, I've just seen. I've just got an image here of 78-7B socks. <laughs> per 10 euros. <laughs> what? They're from Heel Tread. Oh my god. I must get these things. The Boneyard match. And the Funhouse match. Yeah, they were they were actually alright, yeah. I did not expect to see these. 787B socks. And they're genuine. They're nine pounds. I must find out how much the shipping is. I could have GTI socks, RSR socks, quad quattro socks. GT40 golf color socks. Nice. What's the shipping? Tell me what the shipping is. Shipping is... I have, It's a £10. It's £20 for a pair of socks. They're coming all... <laughs> all heel drive. Uh... There's Lamborghini Venino socks. Super chop. What the hell? Oh, what is this? Look at this gaggle. Well, that's the, uh, the Sauber's passed it. Finally. Will it actually pull away? That's the question. Oh, the poor, poor Parnos. Shake up the race for third. Yes, it definitely has. I'm just looking at what is called the Supercharger Pack and includes every single pair of socks for the low, low price of £176. Yes, for socks. There are at least WRC socks. There's Alpha 155 socks as well. F40. Delta Integrale with the Martini colors. GTO, Mura, GTA. LP400. It's all orange. Well, we're 20 minutes to go. 
He's coming up to his end of a stint. He's matching the 787B for pace, so I guess that's fine. We'll see how much some carton shoes are. Hmm. Do, 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 do. Carting boots. Uh, expensive, expensive, expensive. Very expensive. What's the highest price carting shoes? I want to. I want to actually. Oh my. God, two hundred and eighty-seven pounds for carting shoes. What? Well, I know where I'm not going to get boots then. All right, you are going to come in at the next lap, my boy. Your stints, your stints are over, mate. You did well, Barney. But unfortunately, it's time for me to do the rest. 15 minutes to go. All right, let's do it. Let's do it. Thirty-six liters of fuel. Here we go. Right, let the chase begin. Here you go, Barney. That's how you do it. Go around cleanly. That's how you increase lap times. Hopefully you'll learn that for Le Mans. That's not what you're supposed to learn either. Cones are still all over the road. Those last two cones are still there. Parnos pitting in. You're not getting away from me, Mazda. Oop. Oop. Stop, 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 no gravel. There it is. I'm getting my lap back, boy. Oh. 
Oh my god. No. No. It's gonna be happening. Get on the road. I see you. That's called the gravel. I don't want to see that. On twenty two. Oh yeah, perfect line. Two minute, two hours, thirty-two minutes. Thirteen minute, less than thirteen minutes to go. See ya. Oh hi again. Bye. Please. And because those two cones are irritating me. Oh, I missed them. I wanted to knock them over, finally. Oh, I wasn't close enough to push it into the pits. That would be the greatest thing in the world if that happened. Right, see ya. Bye. Go, starting to pull away. Well, technically, it wasn't really necessary. I'd still like my lap back. Why right, can I hit those cones now? That's one. There it is. And for those wondering, yes, that was technically the line. My line. Yeah. Oh, nearly hit the corner of the damn wall. That's a huge curb. Ten minutes to go. Ten minutes left, that's ten minutes to go. Oh, uh, Jim would not be liked in GT4. It would berate me so very much. And Barney. There's a cone. There it is. Ha ha! That's all the cones! At least on that corner. I'm not interested in the rest. Although, just for good measure. Dear cones. On nineteen. P 
put every single cone where they belong? No. I can't do that in two minutes. It's impossible. Hey, Chaser, how are you? I'll tell you what. In here it is lovely and cool now. It actually feels like a room worth in being in. Oh, the coolness. Right, Sauber is pitting in. It is looking like it's going to get a podium. Oh, I wonder if I can actually... Oh my god, the braking. Watching the sunset out my window. Now there's a pleasant way to spend the evening. Meanwhile, here I am trying to i going to teach B-Spec Barney a few tricks. Oh, it's coming out of the pits. That's the Nissan. See ya. Bye. Eight minutes to go. Less than eight minutes. Rain. It was raining cats and dogs this entire day. Oh dear, rain? We're supposed to be having thunderstorms tomorrow. Wonderful. Oh my lord, the traction control. I'd kill those cones for a moment. Sonoma. Or Infineon for GT4 purists. That's the Salbert. See ya. Bye. What, dude? What, double diffuser of a car? Nah. Oh. Oh, it's a Jag, I was about to say. Hi, Jag friend. Goodbye, not so gentlemanly Jag. There goes two other cones. Move. Ah. <laughs> uh, bye. Oh God. Oh, that's what that's what I get for looking behind. Uh. Use the panini. Wait a minute. This isn't Italian. Right. We are five minutes to go. The nickname for the Parnos, but the Panini. <sighs> oh, my back is killing me. Lower back. Has no cheesini. Well, you don't really need cheese to make a panini. Although, it wouldn't be a panini without cheese. If you have a panini and no cheese, it just becomes some kind of... Some kind of striped sandwich. For gold trials. Well, GT3, yeah. Get off.
Jags pitting in. Seventy eight seven B is pitting in for its final splash of dash. Dry ass sandwich. It's a, it's it's what would happen if you flattened a if you flattened a powdered roll. And then decide to put and then decide to put it in the in the toaster for some reason. Look, three cones in a row. Oh wow, the oversteer is really starting to set in. Yeah, kinda. Anyway, it looks like two laps to go. I can't, I'm not really sure because my time is covered up and I can't see it because of the chat, because of the chat. My chat window is a bit, well, my custom chat window, the restream chat window is uh, quite enormous and I can't see. Yep, it is. Will be your final lap. Who knows? If the lap, if my net, if my next lap is something like a 118, then yes. Oh my god! These tires are dead. These tires are dead. I'm going to go for a fuel saving strategy. Right. This lap is my last lap. Unless the game for some reason thinks... Unless for some reason the game thinks that I'm actually nowhere near that time and I shall have to be punished further. Here we go, 10 seconds, guys. Five, four, three, two, one. Should be race over now. Yep. That's that. Gotcha, Rata. Ragazzi. That's that, ladies and gentlemen. 116 laps of hell. 466 kilometers. Yes, it was. Let's get a pretty picture of the 78 7B. Actually, no, let's get a pretty picture of a set of the Jag. Well, that's half a million credits. Now, what do we get after this perilous and terrifying journey around Sonoma? Sonoma! I don't want to hear Sears Point or Infineon. I think it did. 
Well... I guess it's rare. Not worth the punishment, though. It really, really wasn't. <laughs>